hello everybody and welcome to my channel my name is Ramon today I got a quick video for you guys it has to do with um, electives I seen electives video everybody keeps asking me about which electives have multiple choice which ones are written exams well from experience I got a few just for you okay so not all of them are gonna be multiple choice it's kind of like a hit or miss but I did hit and I found out which one it is so there's no missing here what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and provide you with the electives that you would need to complete this as fast as possible because that's what we're all trying to do we're just trying to get our diplomas right but learn on the way to the end so there's two options here you could go ahead if you don't really care about you know is it multiple choice or writing exams you could choose the electives uh, pathways so if you choose the electives pathways it's like pretty much you're going for uh, that career after you graduate like if they have a let's say for example business management or a, a cook game being a chef uh, taking care of kids health care well you could choose one of those pathways and I believe I think that once if you do all those in that pathway you're gonna get two certificates one a high school diploma and one for completing the pathway now if you're like me who just wanted to finish quick and did not want to do any written exams I did pick a pathway it wasn't easy at all so I had to give them a call and I had to change like I gave them a call and I had to change my electives I had to pay like $50 or so to change all my electives since I did choose a pathway and it's just too hard time consuming and a lot of written exams just one out of the five electives had six exams written exams so I went ahead and I just knew I ain't choosing that but if you're trying to finish this quick here I'm gonna go ahead and provide you with five multiple choice not nothing written here halfway and wait, wait, wait. <laughs> electives all right now, if you can all go ahead and like this video and subscribe to my channel, and I'm gonna go ahead and get started. All right, the first one we have here is, oh, look at this meme. When a teacher walks up to you during an exam and looks at your paper, then shouts, guys, make sure you read the questions carefully. Has this happened to any of you? Happened to me a lot, a lot. All right, first one on the list is, multiple choice and I think it's not even hard these I'm gonna give you are all easy electives the very last one is gonna be the hard elective all right the first one is medical administrative assistant this one doesn't have that many uh, exams in the course and it's all multiple choice easy as one of the other bunch the second one small business management and I don't mean the pathway, I mean just the course. You scroll, there's the pathways on top, you scroll all the way to the bottom, and you find this. This one is also one of the easiest ones of the selection. The third one is geometry. Again, super easy and all multiple choice. The third one is business math. Again, easy and one of the best ones to pick. Like my whole list. The third one, which was the most easiest, and I thought it was going to be a little hard, and I thought it was going to have written exams, but multiple choice, Microsoft and Word Excel. All simple. They're all common sense. You don't, like, I didn't even need to study for these. That's how common sense they were. They're just, like, asking questions. Some of them, just, like, business math or small business, I think one of those, they just ask, like, money, like, if, if blah, blah, got paid this much money, and got a deposit of blah blah and blah blah he ends up with blah blah it's like so simple and now I'm gonna give you the very last one this one is the very like the hardest one of the bunch right okay you ready for this chemistry it's multiple choice there's like six of them six four like six exams in this course but it's all multiple choice but it's one of the hardest multiple choice ones that I have ever done now this whole list right here are all electives 
So if you choose any of these electives from the top, I like you'll finish like really fast. They're not hard at all. You won't even fail one exam. If you fail one of the exams, then like don't just go straight to it. Do some studying. Go through the course. Remember, you're paying for this education. Go through the course. Just do it. It's education you're paying for. And if you fail it one time because you didn't go through the course, you get a second try. You got to retake. Go through it. Learn something. Okay, so these are going to be my, this is going to be like my video for the day. Just letting you all know since uh, you're all asking about electives and this is the very final step before you graduate. Um, I'm going to be making a another video like uh, around, I think tom yeah, tomorrow, Monday. It has to do with, uh, it's a written exam. I did the first one and I'm going to be doing the second one. What's, what is it called? Um, I forgot. Anyways, the second written is, oh yeah, it's called written communication. I did a live video of developing ideas, and now I'm going to do a live video tomorrow, Monday, uh, completing written communication. Now, if you all want to be a part of that live, I'm, I'm going to, I guess I'm going to start it around, let's say 5 o'clock p.m. 5 to 6. 5 to 7 around that time frame I'm mean, gonna I'm be doing the live video doing written communications if you're stuck on that one because I keep getting asked and again for all those contacting me on my Instagram I don't mind answering questions but I will not I repeat will not be doing your exams for you I made plenty of videos and if you go to my Penn Foster journey folder playlist on my YouTube channel you will find that I answer most of all your questions and if you can't follow those videos from the beginning to the end then you're not really trying at all because I step by step do these written exams for you the only one I haven't done is personal narrative because that one is about you it's a personal like something that happened to you using the word I 750 to two, 1000 something words alright that's gonna end my video for the day uh, go ahead and subscribe if you haven't done so like this video leave a comment below and also leave another comment below if you're this guy right here if this has ever happened to you <laughs> all right thank you for watching and see you on the next video peace